New at 6, the Super Bowl will be here in 40 days, and it's expected to be a boost for tourism and local businesses after a couple of tumultuous years. Team 12's Colleen Sakura is in downtown Phoenix tonight looking at the expected impact on local businesses. While the festivities will be in Glendale, here in downtown Phoenix and all across the valley, the Super Bowl is expected to make a big difference for local businesses and restaurants that struggled through a pandemic, non-existent tourism, and inflation. 2020 was what you might call a tunnel for Ricardo Aguirre. During COVID, we had to shut down. His catering business, Tamales y Tacos Puebla, closed for 10 months. It was definitely a challenge uh, in regards to the many contracts that we lost. And losing several family members to COVID too. We were very grateful, you know, to have people on our, on our side, you know, that rooted for us. And because of them, we were able to bounce back. Bouncing back, now nearly ready to be in the light. I always say there's a light at the end of the tunnel and the Super Bowl, that's what it, it is to us. The tunnel of the pandemic affecting Arizona. We lost 1,200 businesses in the food service industry just in the COVID um, pandemic. Tim Castro, Local First Director of Business Development, says while COVID funding did help keep a lot of businesses going. We're looking at another adrenaline shot. The Super Bowl is expected to bring 600 million into the environment, into our local business ecosystem. Aguirre's business landed a contract with the Super Bowl, feeding 2,000 stadium staff over 11 days. His normal crew of eight more than doubling for the spotlight on Arizona and the Valley. We're going to be a full staff of 20. So we're going to be prepping, we're going to be cooking, we're going to be selling. It's going to be a lot of work, but it's definitely going to be worth it. Colleen Sikora, 12 News.